imagine you're watching a movie and somebody says let's play imagine you are studying something peacefully and somebody says let's solve these problems our mind does not like too many variations when you are engrossed and when the momentum is built for doing a particular thing and that's exactly applicable while studies as well and especially for need preparation so my dear warriors my dear lions this is your captain shreyas your physics master teacher on the vedanto neat english channel and today i have got to you an amazing important strategy of studying the 11th and the 12th chapters together and that too those chapters which are related to each other and sometimes you need to study these chapters in a particular sequence only then you will be able to efficiently cover maximum syllabus in very little time in fact the strategy is so cool that i will make you cover the entire syllabus in just 5 months yes you heard it right 5 months and the remaining time you can use it for your boards or for your revision your mock test it's up to you in fact i'll be making a separate strategy video later on but for that these next 5 months a detailed plan with the chapter list is given by your captain shreyas just make sure you follow it and apart from following that make sure you're following this channel too by subscribing or else you'll get a lot of cool videos and make sure you also like this video okay thank you so much for liking so here is a year long plan starting off with let's say august i hope you are watching this video in august if you delay this further you start with september obviously the plan also gets shifted by a month unless you are able to cope up and cover up all those things which you missed in that particular month so you start off in month 1 cover a few 12th chapters then some 11th chapters your major focus will be on the 12th chapters that also means that you cannot ignore 11th standard syllabus this is a most common mistakes which many students do in 12th standard and if you are a dropper well then so you will be focusing on 11th and 12th equally because you do not have any board examinations so you start off with both the syllabus obviously if you are a dropper you will give equal weightage if you are a fresher then you will give more preference on the 12th standard and then slowly cover up all the chapters by december right so that when the next year begins january comes you start off with revision mock test series final laps revision number 2 or maybe you are preparing for your board examinations practicals if you are a fresher if you are a dropper then you have all the time just for revision and revision alone and trust me you need those 4 months for your final revision january february march and april because only then you can be sure that no matter what question comes in the examination you will be able to crack it now talking about the exact list of the chapters that you need to cover side by side like starting off with physics then i'll go to chemistry and biology of course in this month august you're going to cover these topics of 12th electrostatics gauss law current electricity and 11 chapters vectors units dimensions and gravitation you can see many things are related because gravity is related to electrostatics if you know, understand and know vectors properly only then you will be able to resolve components and you can show the electric fields etc properly then next month you start off with capacitors magnetic effects magnetism everything motion in 1d 2d newton's laws friction circular and work power energy okay you will need lot of concepts of work power energy circular motion in magnetism as well and of course drawing free body diagrams is very important because you will be finding forces on current carrying wires etc all right then you go to ray optics emi quite independent but at the same time you will see a little bit of relationship of emi with rigid body and rotation center of mass and collisions are required for studying rigid body then you go to complete waves unit beat electromagnetic waves light waves sound waves hm oscillations solids and even alternating current that's what our month is for and december is for modern physics logic gates semiconductors and the remaining low weightage topics like thermal physics thermodynamics heat transfer fluids ktg etc so that's your entire plan. you can take a screenshot and make sure you follow it then going on to botany this is your entire flow right from august to december starting off with sexual reproduction in flowering plants the living world biological classification then you go to principles of inheritance cell unit cell cycle division of life molecular basis of inheritance plant kingdom in october in november you go to microbes in human welfare morphology of flowering plants anatomy of flowering plants and finally you end december with ecology and plant physiology right then talking about zoology 
this is the flow starting off with human reproduction that is itself a huge unit in itself then you go to biomolecules and animal kingdom and then evolution human health and diseases structural organization in animals biotechnology and human psychology and then you end it in december with those remaining chapters right then talking about chemistry we start off with solutions chemical kinetics mole concept structure of atom all these are related chapters you go on to inorganic chemistry in september you go on to organic chemistry in october and you complete that organic chemistry by november and a little bit of physical out there and the remaining parts of physical or organic chemistry finish it off or even inorganic finish it off by december so that's your chemistry plan trust me this is the best best plan for completing related chapters together completing your backlogs if you are worried about your backlogs this is the plan for you if you are a dropper trust me if you complete the syllabus in the next 5 months you will be so thankful for whatever you are decision you have made today that you will get so much time right from january to april to revise the syllabus multiple number of times and we have to give in our 100% for the final neat 2025 examination and if you're worried where i can cover all this syllabus of course the link for joining the dna batch is there in the description box below obviously apart from the syllabus completion in this particular dna batch you are also going to get the test series assignments the coaching module and a lot of ebooks be it mtg be it your disha publications or you know previous year papers assignment generators everything and of course we are only teaching over there it's in pure english doubt solving is there within the class and you get proper report cards after every test all india level ranking and all of that very affordable prices you can check out which is there in the description box along with different combinations like if you want it with the year long test series or whether you want it with the tatva module so all these combination offers are also available these are hard copy materials at very very affordable prices okay so i want to hear from all of you whether you are going to complete 11th and 12th standard syllabus simultaneously and whether you are going to stick to this plan and complete the syllabus in the next 5 months comment below 11th and 12th together okay thank you for liking thank you for subscribing this is your captain shreya signing off bye bye